tune in to the new podcast, Stories from the Village of Nothing Much, like easy listening, but for fiction. If you've overdosed on bad news, we invite you into a world where the glimmers of goodness in everyday life are all around you. I'm Catherine Nikolai, and I'm an architect of Cozy. Come spend some time where everyone is welcome and the default is kindness. Listen, relax, enjoy. Listen to stories from the Village of Nothing Much on the iHeartRadio app, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you get your podcasts. It's a weird world out there, so lean into the weirdness with the Stuff to Blow Your Mind podcast. Explore the nature of dreams and how dreaming has influenced culture. Appreciate the deep strangeness of terrestrial biology, as well as purely imagined creatures that reveal much about human nature. Explore topics scientific, historical, philosophical, and sometimes monstrous on Stuff to Blow Your Mind. Listen to Stuff to Blow Your Mind on the iHeartRadio app, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you get your podcasts. Hey, this is Prop from the Hood Politics with Prop Podcast. And this is what we do here. We take all these highfalutin political ideas and things in the news and explain it to you in a language that we all speak in. Just like, I don't know, take filibustering. Believe it or not, you already know what that is. Because if you got a mama that don't play no games... You've been filibustering your whole life. Hey, mom, no, look, listen, 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 mom. Before you make your decision, what had happened was everything said after that is a filibuster. You just trying to stall her out to avoid the inevitable. Congress do it all the time. See, you already knew. So listen to Hood Politics with Prop on the iHeartRadio app, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you get your podcasts. Professional dancer Cheryl Burke has been part of Dancing with the Stars since the very beginning. 26 seasons of the Samba, the Rumba, and the Cha-Cha. 24 partners, 6 finals, and 2 Mirabal trophies. She knows all the secrets, the behind-the-scenes arguments, and the affairs, the flings, the flirting, and the fighting. Listen to Sex, Lies, and Spray Tans on the iHeartRadio app, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you get your podcasts. You don't know me. Confession I can't take back. I am... The Masked... Speaker. Got a text 78592 that says, My wife forgot my birthday mm. and spent the entire day planning what she wanted us to do for her birthday, ah. which is seven months away. That <laughs> makes it worse. And so to get even, I ate her secret stash of mini Snickers bars. <laughs> oh, no. Because I know where she hides them. <laughs> it's funny because it's like, sounds like it's nothing, but it's probably huge. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. That led to a seven month fight. Yeah. Uh huh. I guess passive aggressive behavior towards your significant. Another is one way to deal with your okay. stress, but another, or say healthier way, mm-hmm. is to come on our show to vent your truth anonymously. <laughs> there we go. No yes. guarantee Brooke won't try and eat your candy though after it's over. Oh, if I find that stash, it's gone. <laughs> <laughs> but we do have one person ready to give us a peek into his secret stash. He wants to go Ooh. by Derek today. So, Derek, welcome to the show. Hey guys, thanks for taking my call. I appreciate it. Oh, very yeah. formal, Derek. How are oh. you feeling? I'm all right. I'm a little distressed. Having a little uh, little bit of anxiety about something. Okay. Brooke's not really going to steal yeah. your Snickers bars, dude. You don't have to worry. That was just a joke. I feel like I want to give Derek a hug. I feel like I need a hug, my friend. This stuff has bothered me for years. Oh, so okay. We're going way back to freshman year in college. Oh. Wow. Okay. Well, yeah. your voice changer is on. You're the mass speaker. Let's hear about your confession. So it was my first year. Um, I didn't really get good grades. I had a very good social life. I hung out a lot, had a lot of friends, yeah. you know, a You're lot of partying. You're making You're not making grades. That's fine. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right. Exactly. Totally. I also had strict parents. Oh. Uh, okay. Who are yeah. probably paying for this? Oh, yeah. To the hilt, I'm sure. It was a lot. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, so they have a re- for college. Yeah, they have a reason why but you should do yeah, that's no. kind of their fault for believing in you. Oh. You know, <laughs> they should know better than to spend that much money on their own child. The parents do do that. Yeah. They dangle it. They're like, yeah. look, we'll help you pay, but you can't fail. Yeah. Or, you know. Is that what you tell your mom, Jeffrey? Oh, after yeah. All the years of private oh, school. Oh, trust me. My dad yeah. wanted me to take microeconomics. That was a terrible idea. Yeah. Uh-oh. And he found out really quickly why. But anyway. That, that course sounds expensive. You have the type of parents that care about you getting good grades. Yes, my parents uh, do care about me in there. Uh-huh. And so I'm back home after the first year, and my father, while I'm in my room one day, comes up to me, and he's like, hey, uh, I want to see your grades. Yeah. Uh-oh. And you're like, oh, 
I go to one of those colleges that don't have them. Yeah. <laughs> they still That's when you log into a friend's account. Yeah. Like, come on. <laughs> I knew that he would freak out if I just showed him the grades. So what I did was, um, do you guys know what the inspect command button does on the... Mm-mm. No. Inspect what is that? Inspect command? Know, copy on, and paste. It's all I know. On what? I don't even... There is no inspect button. If you click right, click on websites. If you click the right on the... Oh, yeah, the mouse. Right. Okay. Uh, you can click inspect, and it pulls up code. Yeah. And okay. in that code, you can change what someone's seeing on the screen. Oh. No way. Wait, you can change what a website says? It, it makes it look a little different, but you're not changing the website. I'm not actually changing yeah, not anything. Changing I'm just changing what my father is seeing in time as I'm showing him on my screen. My okay. mind is feeling so blown right now. I have to I, look this up. I've Adrian. accidentally clicked this a few times, and I'm always like, oh, my gosh, what are these codes? And I get out of that. Dude, I feel like you should get an A just for being able to do that. Yeah, yeah. I didn't even know that was a I thing. I appreciate that. I know a lot of ways around things and getting away with stuff. Okay. You're smart <laughs> when you want to be. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So he was so happy to see those grades. He was so astounded. Static you and show excited. Him? Did you show them all A's or did you get some B's in there too? Oh, oh yeah, yeah. No, I put some B's in there. Mostly A's though. We had uh, like okay. a B in science. My father wouldn't believe I got an A in science. Oh, okay. <laughs> Keeping it realistic. Like, sorry, Dad, I really messed up. This one was a B minus. I'm yeah, so yeah. sorry. Don't kick me out. Right. It kind of added to what seemed made it seem more truthful and honest. Good, good. Well, my good. Did he believe it? He believed it so much that he wanted me to print up the page. Oh, oh, wait, can you do that? Yeah, no, I did print it up. I printed it up for him. Oh, okay. But he did that because he wanted to send that to my car insurance company to get me a lower rate oh, because oh, I get no. better grades. That's right. <laughs> wait, they do that? Yeah. yeah, they do like good student discounts at yeah. some insurance companies. Yeah. Yeah. Funny that Alexis never knew that that was I a know. possibility. <laughs> I, I didn't she know didn't that existed. Know. Yeah. <laughs> so wait, so what, who, what do you feel guilty about? Just scamming the insurance company? I may or may not have been committing insurance fraud for the last few years. Yeah, I think that's, that's a good point. kind of a problem. <laughs> oh, my God. Hey, well, Jeff just didn't pay insurance for like three years. That's so at well, least you're better yeah. than I like that. <laughs> that's a good point. Well, yeah, yeah, he's that. not defrauding the company. Yeah, yeah. I just want to make sure I'm not going to go to jail. Okay. God, well, I think, yeah. yeah, it'd probably be your dad that went because yeah. he's oh, the well, one that was on the policy. He'd be he's an accomplice. Yeah. It wasn't your fault. You're not the person that sent your phony grades to True. the insurance company. He made the phony no, grades. right. It was not my fault. I didn't know. I figured maybe no. he wanted to put it on the fridge it or something. Is your fault. I, yeah, yeah. I just want to be that guy. Yeah, like, yeah. You, you literally. No, just say it was a computer glitch. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it, it, it just happened. So, did you get caught? <laughs> Uh, no, no, I still haven't gotten caught. No, I haven't gotten caught. Oh, uh, that's why you feel guilty. He's just looking at around his shoulder at every turn, waiting for the insurance agency <laughs> to bust him. Right. I don't want this to be the last thing I tell my dad on his deathbed. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> wow. I think just keep that one to yourself. Yeah. yeah. You, know, you, you saved him proud. money, and mm-hmm. he was proud of you. Mm-hmm. But now I learned a great new trick. Whenever, like, management comes over and wants to see our Nielsen ratings online, I'm just going to go <laughs> in there. Look at that. One billion listening hours. Yeah, somehow, Amazing. Somehow we surpassed number one. We're at number zero now. That's even better. Oh, good for us. Hey, thanks for sharing that with us, Derek. That was a good one, man. Thanks for listening, guys. Text in 78592 if you have a confession you've been holding on to. We can hide your identity, mask your voice, and make you the next mass speaker. Yeah. Your phone tap's coming up. Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning. My brother-in-law died suddenly, and now my sister and her kids have to sell their home. That's why I told my husband we could not put off getting life insurance any longer. An agent offered us a 10-year, $500,000 policy for nearly $50 a month. Then we called SelectQuote. SelectQuote found us identical coverage for only $19 a month, a savings of $369 a year. Whether you need a $500,000 policy or a $5 million policy, Select Quote could save you more than 50% on term life insurance. For your free quote, go to SelectQuote.com. SelectQuote.com. That's SelectQuote.com. Select Quote. We shop, you save. Full details on example policies at SelectQuote.com slash commercials. Tune in to the new podcast, Stories from the Village of Nothing Much. Like easy listening, but for fiction. If you've overdosed on bad news, we invite you into a world where the glimmers of goodness in everyday life are all around you. 
I'm Catherine Nikolai, and I'm an architect of Cozy. Come spend some time where everyone is welcome and the default is kindness. Listen, relax, enjoy. Listen to stories from the Village of Nothing Much on the iHeartRadio app, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you get your podcasts. It's a weird world out there, so lean into the weirdness with the Stuff to Blow Your Mind podcast. Explore the nature of dreams and how dreaming has influenced culture. Appreciate the deep strangeness of terrestrial biology, as well as purely imagined creatures that reveal much about human nature. Explore topics scientific, historical, philosophical, and sometimes monstrous on Stuff to Blow Your Mind. Listen to Stuff to Blow Your Mind on the iHeartRadio app, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you get your podcasts. Hey, this is Prop from the Hood Politics with Prop Podcast. And this is what we do here. We take all these highfalutin political ideas and things in the news and explain it to you in a language that we all speak in. Just like, I don't know, take filibuster. Believe it or not, you already know what that is. Because if you got a mama that don't play no games... You've been filibustering your whole life. Hey, mom, no, look, listen, 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 mom. Before you make your decision, what had happened was everything said after that is a filibuster. You just trying to stall her out to avoid the inevitable. Congress do it all the time. See, you already knew. So listen to Hood Politics with Prop on the iHeartRadio app, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you get your podcasts.